everybody, this is Praxis, and today I'm doing a really critical project in relation to our survival and making sure that this house could live through an apocalypse, and that's putting up some tile around the bathroom. Uh, um, yeah, it's not really all that critical, but it, it'll finish up the space, it'll make it look handsome, and I suppose it does have a practical use. Uh, as you can see over here, the uh, shower fixture is just coming out of the wood. I know from experience that if you just kind of leave it like that, you know, there's always going to be spray back and it'll start rotting out the wood back there, or at the very least it'll get mildew on it. So I want to finish up this, uh, this space here. Uh, this is the tile I'm going to be using. It's the same tile I've used all over the place. It's the floor tile from the bathroom above. I use it all over the place. It's, uh, oh, the, the kitchen. The kitchen's the other place. I pre-cut the tile. The kitchen's not done yet, but, uh, yeah, I've been using this kind of slate tile for everything. Uh, I haven't cut any of the pieces, uh, to go up there yet. What I'm doing first is I'm putting kind of a trim piece around the whole, uh, place. Uh, this is coming up here. I just hammer this in and... This is going to go right up in here, and this will be tile under here. It was a little bit uh, difficult because this piece here needs to be able to come out. Uh, this is an access panel. This removes, and then the entire ceiling can drop down, so you can get it, everything up there. So in kind of uh, figuring this space out, I kind of I had to figure out a way of doing it where uh, that would be allowed. And uh, what I'm, I'm doing is... Uh, just kind of cutting it right under here so the whole thing can kind of uh, come out. So um, that's what I'm in the middle of doing right now. And what I wanted to mention to you guys in this video specifically is the nails that I'm using are nails that I've been saving up for years. Uh, these are nails that don't have much of a head on them there. And you might say, oh, well, that's, a, that's called a finish nail. And you'd be kind of right uh, because finish nails are nails that have a very small head here so that you can't really see uh, that they are there. There's just you know, it's a little more attractive, whatever. Um, the real, I didn't buy these though. The real reason I'm using these is that these are actually 8D nails, or 6D nails, I think, uh, that I just accumulated over the years, and they were manufacturing defects where they didn't have a head. So uh, for things where I really wanted to have the head hold the board down, I didn't want to use these, so I've been throwing them into little buckets, and now's a great time to use them for finish work. So if you're working through, uh, you know, a big project, and you're getting some of these, you know, quote-unquote dud nails, hold on to them because they can be useful for different things. You know, these are not good for holding down boards because they're missing their head, but for trim work, they're just what the doctor ordered. That's it. Thanks for watching.